Hey everyone! Today I'm going to go over a simple way to run external programs from the Unity Editor on Windows. In several of my projects, I have external tools that perform tasks that aren't integrated with Unity. For example, before I build one of my games, I need to run a command line tool that generates some special classes to efficiently serialize and deserialize my save data. Previously, I was opening up a PowerShell window, navigating to the command line tools folder, and typing out the command by hand. I wondered if I could somehow automate this process and run it from a menu item in Unity. It's actually really simple. First we define a static method and give it a menu item attribute. I usually put my commands under the existing tools menu. Next we define the command we want to run. This is specific to whatever you're trying to accomplish, so I won't go into too much detail about what I'm doing here. If you're running a command with command prompt or PowerShell, you may need to replace all forward slashes with backslashes. Now we start the external program using the system.diagnostics.process class. There are several different versions of the start function that allow you to specify a bunch of special options, but so far I've only used the simpler ones that just take the name of the program you want to run and the command you want to run with it. This starts PowerShell and runs the command I defined above. We then wait for the command to finish and close the process. This will cause the Unity editor to become unresponsive while the command is running, so bear that in mind. A note about working with PowerShell. By default, the PowerShell window will close when the command has finished, even if there's an error. This can make debugging very difficult. If you want the PowerShell window to remain open until you manually close it, add the no exit flag and then use the command flag to specify your command. Make sure to remove these flags when you're done fixing up the command. Process.start can be used to run other Windows programs, like the File Explorer. In this example, I created a menu item that opens the folder where my save data is located. This has honestly saved me a lot of time. I'm sure you can think of other ways to speed up your development process using this approach. If you have any thoughts on this approach, let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching.